Yeah, it's recording. Okay, good. Um, hi everybody, welcome back for take two of my video interview with Mr. Walling from BHS. Hi. <coughs> <laughs> Me and the mayor. <laughs> um, <coughs> so today I will be having a video interview with Mr. Walling from BHS. Uh, <coughs> Mr. Walling, could you tell us a little bit about yourself and what your and your interest in what you like to do sure pal first and foremost thank you so much for having me on your show yeah really appreciate okay. it and um i always think this is great because like i was jokingly saying to ethan a while ago no one really thinks of teachers other than in their position with their teacher hat on <laughs> uh and here i am talking about like things about me outside of the classroom um so a little bit about myself um, basically, like when I'm not teaching, you know, I have my family, I have my three lovely kids and my wife, but when I talk about my hobbies and interests, as a lot of people here at the school know, I'm a big music guy. Um, so I've been, uh, I used to play in bands when I was a younger man, and I've always been uh, very, very deeply interested in music from the time I was a little kid, running around my parents' place with the record player, scratching them all up. Uh, but yeah, so I'd have to say my hobbies and interests at this point, uh, if it's not something that I'm doing with my fam, usually it's something music related, either playing a little bit, probably not as much as I used to, um, or collecting music. I'm a big music collector. Okay, and uh, what type of music do you like the most? This is, I always find that an interesting. You're, you're asking all the all the big questions here. You're <laughs> putting me on the spot. Uh, I was. I'd have to say, if I talked about what type of music I lo like the most, because I am a former pretentious record store nerd. Uh, <laughs> that's a very loaded question. But if I had to pick, um, where people used to come in all the time, and I, I've had this question asked me so many times. And I think I've narrowed it down. I can't say a style of music I like the most, but if I had to pick, it'd probably be uh, the Grateful Dead. The Grateful Dead are my fa is my favorite type of music because it's sp it spanned this super long career uh, from '67 to '95, and they kind of went in all these different directions, and it was always interesting and always like a little off the wall, just like me, my friend. <laughs> uh, what type of music did you listen to growing up? So, I grew up in a magical time called the 1900s. Uh, <laughs> and I, when I was your age, it would have been in the mid to late 90s. Um, and so growing up at that point, that was when like people have been talking about this grunge revival, like alternative music's kind of come back. People love bands like Nirvana and... Um, you know, bands of that kind of ilk from like Seattle in the early 90s. But I, oops, sorry, squeaky. I, uh, <laughs> I, uh, I grew up listening to a lot of punk music. I liked it, I liked it fast and loud. And I really, uh, I listened to a lot of hip hop too, because that was kind of a golden age for hip hop in the mid 90s. So that's kind of where I was at musically when I was, uh, when I was your age. Um, I know, I know you have a lot, a bunch of records. Could you tell us a little bit more about your collection? Well, certainly, Ethan. I, uh, <laughs> I actually, yes, I have. I've been recording. Um, what I've been recording? What am I talking? About? <laughs> I've been, I've been collecting <laughs> records for a very, very long time. Um, and if I was to explain something about my collection. I would, the best way I could explain would be that there's like, it's all meat, no fat. Because one of the things I've done uh, over the years, I've always had kind of a, like even as a teacher, I've always had a bit of a side hustle where I sell records online. So anything that I don't really love, I've just gotten rid of. So now I can honestly say of my entire collection, I can kind of dig through anything and pull something out. For example, let's see. Yes. Boom. Great album, Eric's Trip. Great East Coast band from Moncton, New Brunswick. This is a fantastic album. And uh, I could do that with my entire collection and always uh, pull the gold nuggets. <laughs> <laughs> I, and oh, I was just asked how many I have. That's actually a really good question too. I think at this point, um, 
I've managed to like sift through and I'd say, I won't say exactly how many, but it's, it's far too many. It's more than you can fit in a bread box, but it'd be like somewhere in the thousands. Thousands. And my <laughs> last question is what got you interested in collecting records? So what actually got me re uh, interested in collecting records was the record store environment. Like I, again, grew up here in Bathurst. Um, and when I was a kiddo, but a runt, I used to <laughs> head downtown to this place that we had called Blah Records. So shout out to Denis Melanson if he's watching. Uh, but Denis had this little record store called Blah Records. And I still remember uh, I was in grade eight and I had got my allowance money and I biked from Parkwood to downtown and I knew that this is a place that I wanted to start going to because it always looked cool. It sounded really, uh, you always heard music coming out of it. And I went and I bought a CD for the first time. So the idea of collecting music, I can honestly say stemmed from like that singular experience. That was the nucleus of it. And then I like moving to different cities, the record stores always like, it's it's this you know like where you walk in it's bright and it's colorful you have great conversations we have great conversations see and uh and that's that's what it's all about so for myself it's it's about the music it's like it's always about the music but it's also like the people um i've met some of my best friends uh on the planet literally due to music so it's funny a lot of people are very um I don't know. How's, how do I explain this? Music is a, a great unifier, as you know, from what you do on your channel, where how many people have reached out to you because of the, the songs that you sing. Okay. You know what I mean? A lot. Exactly. And so that idea this music is a, a great unifier. And I love that about it. And that's why I've been collecting music since I can. Jeez, I don't even know if I can remember when I started. And just so you guys know, I'm actually inspiring someone here. Really? Uh, well, that graduated from here in 2014. Yeah. He is really uh, inspired by me, so I'm really happy to be able to do that. And well, that's fantastic. People. I love uh, to hear that. Yeah. Thank you very much, Mr. Walling, for coming on my YouTube channel today. I really appreciate it. Thank you, Ethan. You're welcome. <laughs> How are you doing? <laughs>